the 1st of May, a very important satanic date. Now let's just take a look at why this is an important satanic date. The English language is based as a foundation upon the Greek language. Now in English you would say the 1st of May, but in Greek you would pronounce it Brody Maya. Brody means the 1st and Maya means May, but it also means magic. So it's the first day of magic, the first of May, the first day of magic. And the first of May is the first of the fifth, one and five, six. So the date begins with a hex, with a number six. In the Greek language, the word six is pronounced exe, mispronounced by witches in the English language as hexi. It's a hex, a number six. It's the first day of magic. And on this first day of magic, people do things like maypole dancing, such as here in the 1700s, where there is a lot of ladies here dancing around a pole with ribbons. And these ribbons go to make this pole into a pyramid shape. And in their hands, they're holding above their heads half dome shaped flower arrangements. Once the magic maypole dance has been completed, the ribbons form crisscross X shapes. So you have a pyramid, you have X's, and you have a side view cutaway disc. The maypole is a simple cryptography of a pyramid, X's representing swirling thrust, and a flying saucer the mark of the beast. The letter M is very important to Freemasons who are also witches. They even have a hand sign which is the M hand sign. May the 1st is also associated with the Mayans from South America. In other words, the magicians. These people were named after an Egyptian official who was given authority over that area and his name was Maya. Magic. And he named the people Magic. And the 1st of May, Brody Maya, the first magic. This is where the magic begins on the 1st of May. So fine, let the magic begin. But Jesus Christ is on his way to end the magic forever.